Hello, my name is Eric. In this video, I'm going to share some things I've learned about the Solid JavaScript framework. As our website says, Solid is a declarative JavaScript library for creating user interfaces. I'll talk about general UI framework concepts, JSX, the Solid framework, and TypeScript. I'm creating this video for my past self, information that would have been useful when I started learning these things. My goal is to provide enough detail to make you comfortable to start using Solid to write a web application or add components to an existing web application. Web development has only been a small part of my career, but I always want to know more. Going way back to 1997, I started with CGI, then Java Server Pages, then ASP.NET, and recently ASP.NET Core. I've taken a lot of training on Angular and React Redux, but never got to use them in a production project. I discovered Solid while searching for a framework to simplify coding a new web component for an existing web application that just uses jQuery. I was looking for something that imposes minimum baggage. I'd read that compared to Angular and React, Vue can more easily integrate into an existing project, so that was my initial choice. A coworker had concerns about performance, and searching for a fast framework led me to Solid. You know, using Solid has been a pleasure. A good developer has a strong sense of skepticism. You shouldn't assume things will work as you hope. With Solid, I kept discovering that things worked better than I expected, and there were powerful APIs for everything I needed. Also paired with JSX, it requires a surprisingly small amount of code, and it has a small bundle size. It can easily integrate into an existing application, and it's extremely fast. For anyone who isn't excited about JavaScript, adding TypeScript to the mix makes for a gift that keeps on giving. For the templating language, Solid recommends JSX as a clear winner, but it also supports tag template literals and Solid's HyperScript variant, if those are things you want to use. They warn you that Solid's JSX might look like React's, but it's not exactly the same. More on that later. 